My name is Bob Edwards, thanking you very much for all the kindnesses that you've given me over the year. I'll be leaving now, joining uh, the Army, I presume. From National Public Radio in Washington, this is Bob Edwards. Dr. Kissinger, as the Watergate cover-up came unraveled, why didn't you quit? Because I felt it was my duty to hold our foreign policy together. Today is the beginning of National Split Pea Soup Week, and it's the debut of this program. I'm Bob Edwards. Good morning, Robert, and uh, this is the 20th of June, and more than that, there's an old saying around these parts that when the crepe myrtle blooms, the watermelons are ripe. I've never heard that saying before. Well, it's a fact, and it works. I have a, a confession. Um, I'm almost 36 years old. I enjoy your show. <laughs> Anybody likes to be in touch with somebody who's honest. Is it true that when you told Sam Phillips you wanted to do gospel, he told you to go out and sin first? No. <laughs> That's how he tells no. them. <laughs> That's the first time I've ever heard that. <laughs> Never heard that before. School started. I asked Adele Rick McCain. Breaking into uh, Susan's report to give you breaking news from New York City, where planes, two planes, have hit both towers of the World Trade Center in lower Manhattan, the upper floors. A year ago today, the United States told the United Nations to withdraw its weapons inspectors from Iraq. At the time, Hans Blix. Did they tell you where to look? Yes, they did. They gave us sites, and that's what, when I became suspicious, then we didn't find anything. Good morning. President Bush meets today at the White House with the Prime Minister of Canada. I'm Bob Edwards. Today is Friday, April 30th. From NPR you were the first person I interviewed for Morning Edition, and I wanted you to be the last. My goodness, how how many years ago was it we did the first one, Bob? Twenty-four and a half. My goodness. Well, time does fly, doesn't it? Thousands of satellites have followed Sputnik, including the two by which you hear XM radio. They are named Rock and Roll, and sometimes they sound like this. Today, XM Public Radio, Channel 133, has a launch of its own. The first Bob Edwards show begins now. Thank you.